A lot of preparing went into the historic coronation, which came with some chuckles, particularly as her heir William practiced with his father. After the release of Charles III, the coronation year on Boxing Day, it's going viral on social media. Prince William and Princess Catherine's sweet moment with King Charles during their rehearsal. While Prince William is practicing his coronation vow with his father and then kiss him on the cheek, William bends down and kisses Charles on the right side of his face. But it seems like Charles isn't quite satisfied. The scene begins with Charles sitting down and William standing in front of him. Charles is dressed in his everyday clothes, a sweet but has a cloak over his shoulders. William, too, is dressed in suit. He says part of the vow but doesn't finish it, saving the entire pledge for the big day. William then asks, Oh, is it the left side? Before adding, your left cheek is better. He obliges giving his father a second peck. And rather than actually touching the crown, he acts out the motion. And instead of kissing his father, he sort of tickles his face with his hand, but then doesn't lean over to plant one on him. At first, it appeared he would just emulate the kiss and saved it, like the vow. But instead, he went through with it, and not just one kiss, but two. It's very rare for the public to see how the royals interact behind closed doors. And this is one of the reasons the documentary is being eagerly embraced. The documentary also captured intimate moments between them, including King Charles poking fun at his sausage fingers as Prince William practices trying to robe on him and the staff at Buckingham Palace welcoming them back at the coronation service. Another scene, the monarch was seen embracing his daughter-in-law with a hug and kiss before Princess Kate dipped into a quick curtsy. King Charles then greeted his granddaughter, Princess Charlotte, in the same way, and Charlotte expertly followed protocol and also curtsied after their hug. Prince George and Prince Louis also hugged their grandfather. Prince William was also spotted brushing Prince George's hair off his forehead. Richard Jackson, the Bishop of Hereford, said to the camera, I think what struck me particularly is how extraordinarily affectionate they are. They're clearly a very close family. Of all the generations, and in a sense... You felt you're part of a family occasion as well as, you know, a royal occasion and an unnational occasion. Charles announced that he bestowed upon William and his wife Catherine the senior royal titles of Prince and Princess of Wales after acceding to the throne. These titles are traditionally held by the eldest son of the monarch and his wife. Charles was made Prince of the Wales by his mother when he was just nine years old, holding the role for over six decades. In this new position making them the most senior royals after the king and queen Camilla. William and Catherine not only played hosting roles throughout the celebrations, but the prince also swore a historic oath to his father at the religious coronation service held at Westminster Abbey. In an emotional moment captured by TV cameras, King Charles showed his heartfelt tribute to his eldest son after William paid homage to him during the coronation at Westminster Abbey in May. In a break with tradition, William was the only royal duke to pay homage to the king during the ceremony, a change thought to have been introduced to preempt any uncertainty over whether Prince Harry and Andrew would or would not be invited to do so. The moment occurred after William gave an oath of allegiance to his father, saying, I, William, Prince of Wales, pledge my loyalty to you in faith and the truth I will bear unto you, as your liege man of life and limb, so help me God. He stood, touched the crown, and kissed Charles on the cheek. With King Charles appearing overcome with emotion, Charles then whispered, Amen, and thank you, William.